Hey guys, what's up? This is Sparks, and I'm going to be showing you guys uh, just a quick review, and uh, I'm going to be installing this mod. This is called the Superheroes Unlimited mod. So this, uh, this, I know that there's uh, Captain America, you know, the Avengers, kind of the that kind of theme, and this is the more of the Batman, the Marvel comics. So this is uh, Batman, Super, uh, Superman, um, Flash, but uh, as you can see now, I'm in the and the Superman, and I am also in game mode uh, survival, so uh, I can fly with the Superman, and I can run really fast. That's really awesome. That's part of the mod. But uh, I'm not going to be a, a big, big help to showing you guys this actual mod. Um, I just kind of wanted to show you guys what's in it. Uh, this mod adds new ores. It adds uh, the uh, black something, Mars rod, uh, Mars rocks, um, I think that's kryptonite right there, that, that stuff that looks just like, uh, the diamonds or, um, emerald ore, but anyway, guys, this is just the mod review, so I will post, um, uh, probably Chimney Swift's, yeah, Chimney Swift's video, uh, he goes in more into depth of, of this mod and kind of explains more what's in it, but I'm going to be installing this mod, so if you guys are starting, interested in this mod, then I will be installing it now. Alright guys, to install this Superheroes Unlimited mod, um, first thing I'm going to probably want you guys to do is uh, go to the my description and you will see this uh, Superheroes Unlimited uh, mod. You'll see the links in the description, so there will be a mod loader link and this will take you to Rizugami's page. And you can download mod loader, so mod loader 1.4.7, download AFLI or direct, it doesn't matter. Um, and you also see Superheroes Unlimited and you guys will just uh, scroll all the way down. You guys can read more about the more about the mod now but if you go to the downloads right here download the latest version um, so that's right here in the Dropbox and if once you guys have both those downloaded and on the desktop just like this you guys are ready to install it and now I um, am going to be recommending Optifine it is not required for this mod but it is great for Minecraft lag so that should be in the game it shouldn't be a mod uh, it, it, it reduces lag in your Minecraft game so to get started, I'm going to want you guys to go to percent app data percent. So you go down to start and you guys type in percent a p p d a t a that's percent app data and another percent. And you see there's roaming folder. You want to click on the roaming folder and this is your current Minecraft. So this is your current game of Minecraft right now that you guys are playing in. So if you guys drag this Minecraft right onto the desktop right here, um if you guys are worried about saves, I will show you guys how to move those over later. But for now, um, th what this is doing, this is force updating your game. So if you guys already have mods installed, which I do. So that's this right here. This is mods installed in this Minecraft. Now I want to get rid of those mods and I want to start clean Minecraft things. So as you can see, this is uh, there's no Minecraft here. And if we log in and we go to, um, if, we start, if we just start logging in. So let's go to Oaksparks O and... And we got our password in. Let's push remember password. And let's log in. Now um, what this is doing. See now there's a Minecraft right there. This is updating my Minecraft. So this is giving a new Minecraft folder. And what this I'm doing this is for is because. Um, so if you guys can either do this. Or you guys can force update your mod or game. Whichever you guys feel like best. But the reason. Excuse me. The reason why I'm doing this is because. A lot of people are getting black screens. And this is just more of a way to get a very clean Minecraft um, Minecraft folder. So this is completely new Minecraft, and you guys are ready to install the mod. So we can click out of Minecraft. Make sure you guys close Minecraft once it is done force updating. And uh, if you click if you click on your old version of Minecraft, the one you guys were playing in, and you see you see your saves right here. If you open your saves, this is your your worlds that you were playing in. So what you do is you just open those saves and you drag these saves into this new Minecraft saves. So it's not that difficult. Just go to your saves and as you can see you don't have any. So just drag those worlds into there. So that's all you guys need to do for those saves. But if you guys know how to do that, which probably you guys do, uh, that you know that's just want to show you guys the basics. So, um, so once you guys have this open, so if you guys have already closed out of this or don't know where I'm at currently, if you go to percent after percent down and start and you click on the roaming folder, and you click on dot minecraft so that will be right here if you just click on if you click on dot minecraft you will see bin resources and saves and, and the other things here but um, if you guys have downloaded these here we want to open mod loader and well actually um, first we want to go to bin and we want to go to minecraft 
if we want if you see this is an executable jar file you want to right click on this and open this with winrar the reason why we have to open it with winrar is because we couldn't w without it so if you guys can um, if you guys don't already have winrar installed there will be a link in the description so you guys can download and install winrar um, if 7zip also works but i'm using winrar so we are ready to delete the meta inf folder if you click on meta inf if you right click on it and you delete the files push ok and that will delete meta inf meta inf does not allow your mods to run so if you guys want to uh, open your mod loader and you move this aside you'll see all these files so you would just want to select all and you want to drag them all into the minecraft.jar that you opened with winrar and push ok now you guys are done with that and you also want to open optifine and then uh, like I said guys this is not required for this mod but I, I, it is recommended for lag so if you want to select all and drag them all in and then you're done with that so we're done with optifine okay so now that you guys have done mod loader and optifine we're gonna open superheroes mod now you will see this is for the Mac version but I'm gonna be installing it for the Dell version so I'm gonna click on this bottom one now you will see this place in minecraft.jar and you'll see this place in armor folder so um, in the minecraft.jar this is the minecraft.jar that you open with winrar so we're going to open this mine we're going to we're going to open this here that says place in minecraft.jar we're going to uh, we're going to open this and you'll see all these files so we're going to select all we're going to drag them all into here into the minecraft.jar that you opened with winrar so then you're done with that and we're going to go back one and you're going to see place in armor folder so if you guys look through these you'll see the achievement and you'll see armor so let's open this armor folder and you'll see the cloth iron power and you'll see armor okay so we're gonna open this armor folder with the superhero unlimited and you'll see batman wolverine superman uh... martian flash uh, so this is all of the armors that they that adds into the game so if we want to select all just right click and select all and drag them all into the armor folder so that is all you guys need to do to download this mod and install it and now let's log into minecraft and let's start playing it so if you guys are having a black screen here uh, please make sure you have force updated your game and uh, followed my directions exactly if you guys are having problems let's go to super flat if you guys are still getting a black screen um, try to refollow this video exactly how I did it and uh, if it's still not working Please leave, a, leave me a comment in the comment section and I'll help you guys as best as I can. So, if we go to our game menu, go to options, video settings, turn that to fast and turn it down to tiny and fog off. And let's go to our game menu. Let's go over to search items and go all the way down and we'll see Batman, Superman. Let's put on the Superman suit right now. So, let's go to survival and bam. Yep. So... As you guys can see, this mod is installed and it is working. So thanks guys for watching. Hope you guys give this video a like and hope you guys subscribe. Thanks.